Hey everybody, I have a 2005 Passat that I got. It is a TDI. Not very many of them made, I guess. Uh, super good shape, but the left rear door was not opening. Now there's a lot of videos on doing the cable bit, reaching in, activating the levers. Um, none of those work for me. And there was one video where the guy reached in with a pry bar and pried back those levers, broke the plastic, and was able to open the door. Uh, I didn't want to go quite that bit. I did not remove the window. So the door was closed. I was able to get in, remove the inner door panel, remove the metal window regulator mount. There's lots of videos on that. It wasn't, I didn't damage anything doing it. Um, <clears throat> I took that side apart to see how it was done and put together so I could have a copy, mostly to put it back together. I started to remove the window trim. The window wasn't going to come out very well. You have to remove these plastic bits on the side. Um, <clears throat> I tried to pop the handle. I tried to activate the lever. That didn't work. Um, let's see if the child lock, the child lock might be. Um, anyways, it wasn't working. So I was able to fully activate both inner and outer levels with the levers with and without the cable. Um, nothing was opening. What I had to end up doing was taking a hammer right here breaking this side bit just pushing this away and that was actually and then it popped right open so something in there was holding the lock assembly locked and this one here is your lock if you push it up out of the way and then your inner door lever would activate can mess with it here to see what works and what doesn't that's fully locked now it works it's really weird uh, anyways I pried this back broke this screw and it released the door so hopefully if that helps uh, new regulators like $80 US uh, I got one coming I uh, hope this helps, helps anybody out there. Thanks.